like Mr. Perry said, it's not an afternoon for uh, speeches, but I want to thank FNB for considering us uh, to be part of the program for Planted Tree and also reminding us the importance of trees. Mr. Lilanda, Rosebud School Group is humbled to be part of this exercise and we sincerely apologize for bringing you this far. Yes, you wanted this activity to be done in Rosebud School, but we do not have space in Rosebud School. And you have realized or noticed that the Rosebud School Group has grown. We now have three schools, Rosebud School itself, Woodford School, Lusaka, and now Baby Ashford Academy. We are grateful that you accepted to come this far. But I'm sure you are appreciating the environment and knowing too well that the trees that you're giving to us this afternoon are safe and they will enjoy and blossom in this environment. We pledge to protect the trees and save them from the everyday environmental challenges. We have stopped talking, we are planting. Thank you. I'll be rather quick. I'd like to thank all the students coming through, to the Web Spark administration, our FNB team as well. I'd like to welcome you all to this Plant a Tree initiative, which we partner with Plant a Million uh, organization. As FNB, we pride ourselves on being able to be focused on our, helping our clients grow and also the communities that we operate in. Our plan, the Tree Initiative, is really there to focus and help on changing um, our attitude from the youngest of groups, like our students here, all the way to us adult professionals around climate change and ensuring that we protect our environment. On the 1st of April, uh, we're going to talk 13 years, and in our 13 years we've been committed to constantly helping our communities that are operating and financing projects that are very helpful for the environment and the climate as a whole. Uh, allow me to commit to you that as FNB, all 650 of us employees have committed that we're going to plant a tree in each and every one of the areas and communities that we operate in and we actually live in. So I'd like to thank you all for coming through. I'm looking forward to us planning. Thanks. Thank you, Ashford and uh, Roadstack School for having us. And thank you, FNB, for making this possible. Plant a million. Um, our slogan is stop talking and start planting. And today, FNB has just done that. They have stopped talking and they're now planting. So, Plant a Million is an initiative that is trying to bring about a tree-based economy and we are doing this through community and school participation and so right now as you can see what we're doing is uh, school participation our aim is to try and mitigate the effects of climate change so you see in an um, industrial setting where you have so much gases being emitted to the atmosphere, you need trees to actually get that carbon. But lack of these trees will make the carbon make a layer in the atmosphere. So once that carbon makes a layer, the heat from the sun will get stuck and that heat actually needs to go back into the atmosphere. So by planting trees, we're trying to control the climate to avoid global warming. So I'm glad that we're here. And once again, FNB, thank you that you're now planting and not just talking. Thank you. Thank you very much. I'm here to present you a poem about trees called Trees, Trees, Trees. Trees can be short, trees can be tall, but whatever kind, we like them all. They give us oxygen, they give us air. We give them love, we give them care. We take care of each as if they were our own. From when they are seedlings to fully grow. From berries to from berries to cherries, from apples to grapes. They give us different fruits. They grow in different shapes. Ah, they are beautiful leaves. 
and they have long brown trunks. We know that the beautiful trees are not junk. They need soil, water, space, and light. We give them these things day and night. So today we all say hooray for, for the tree's special day, which is called Ava Day. Plant a tree and build a forest. Plant a tree and save a life. Plant a tree, protect a bird. Plant a tree to rebuild the earth. This is all we had for you today. Thank you. Please provide many things to our lives. Please provide food. Please protect the land. Please give oxygen. Please provide shelter and shade. As Ashford Academy, we are grateful for the trees you have given us and, and planted today. We promise that we will take care of these trees so that the fruits of this event will be evident in the future. We hope to, we hope to invite you next year to enjoy the fruits of this event. Thank you. We have to raise the plant up a bit and we have to make a surface like the bottom has to be soft enough like for the roots. We don't want a harsh surface so that the roots can grow properly. Right now Miss Namonja is demonstrating how to plant a tree. Tree is big though. Mr. Mr. Chinyanta. Mr. Chinyanta knows these things. And uh, he's observing keenly. Francis, yes, and Felix, we should catch up. Francis, catch up. What I said. So you move the police in back. Don't plan. I see people creating space at the bottom. And make sure you do it in such a way that you don't shake off the soil because um, we don't want to stress the roots again. Yeah. So you put it at the center and now it's going to go through. Then you bury. So we are at a very important stage to ensure the success of what we are doing. Mixing the soils of different textures. <laughs> Is it compatible with the soil? Yeah, somehow compact, but we're trying to prevent, for example, when water comes when it rains, you don't want the soil to run off. So that's why you start from the We shall mark this one as well for you. You can do this. Ah, this is great. Uh, Mr. Lungu is about to plant a tree. Mr. Lungu, I want to really take note of this one. I will personally be in charge. I will help you. So 
Ambaye hauvisa lungwe ni misa chinyanta Misa chinyanta what the specific name of that tree you are about to plant? I can see it an orange. How are you? What are you learning from this uh, tree planting exercise? Um, I'm, I'm learning that planting a lot of trees can help. Um, let's say if you have a lot of sun, it can help shade, fruit, fruit juice, it can make a lot of fruit juice, a lot of fruit, helps birds in a lot of ways. And so what, what are your words to those people that cut down trees? Um, my advice is please stop cutting trees. Mm -hmm. um, most, many of us eat a lot of fruit, so my advice is if you want to eat more, stop talking and start planting. Okay. And you always have encouragement to your fellow young people? Um, you can start planting at your school, at your home. Just start with a flower and go bigger. Wonderful, it was nice talking to you. Thank you. Good afternoon, Limpan Yamikani. Good afternoon. Yes, um, what are you learning from this uh, tree planting exercise? We learned the importance of trees and how we can actually uh, improve the environment by planting. We also learned that it takes 
one tree to serve a lot of life. Okay. Yes. What do you think uh, there are some of the benefits of planting trees? Yeah, for starters, trees help with the oxygen cycle. It also helps and it is an inhabitant for animals mm. such as birds. So what are, what are your words or your words of caution to those that cut down trees? Uh, we'd like to spread the awareness that a tree is a very important creation by God and it deserves to be planted so that the future generations can come. If we continue cutting trees, certain trees will become extinct and our future generations might not get to Wonderful. And what are your words of encouragement to your fellow youths? Guys, plant more trees. Remember, one tree can live a life. Exactly. <laughs> Alright, thank you so much. It's nice yeah, to you. <laughs> okay, what's your name? Uh, my name is Nisseli Mulewa. Okay, what grade are you doing? I'm in grade 7 red. <laughs> Wonderful. What are you learning from this tree planting exercise? Um, I'm not going to Yeah, and what are your words of encouragement to those people that cut trees? Uh, stop cutting trees. I mean, yes, it's for firewood, but this is for oxygen. 